That's right. Grilling season is here. Goodness. And uh, when it comes to cooking out, uh, many turn out to meats. You know, they went to meats like the hot dogs, right? The the, the burgers, the chicken, the ribs. But uh, when you think of classic barbecue meals, can you imagine it without without meat? Think about that. Healthier options can benefit not only you, but possibly the planet by reducing the carbon footprint. Well, we're a few days away from the holiday weekend and mouthwatering barbecue will likely be piled on plates across the country. But what about adding some different options to the menu. Some of us need help with the subject, and I'm one of those people. So let's bring in our nutritionist and health coach, Karina Heinrich, uh, joins us with some meatless meal ideas for the whole family, the entire family can enjoy. And Karina, what are some tips really for creating a healthier barbecue plate that reduces our meat intake? Absolutely. So you want to focus on filling at least half your plate with fresh or grilled vegetables. Now, my kids, just like you mentioned, love that classic hamburger or hot dog, but it's always nice to switch things up, offer them a superfood nutritional powerhouse salmon burger, still kind of a meat, but it's a lot healthier. You always want to choose a whole wheat bun. You can easily wrap salmon burgers or veggies and lettuce wraps, serve it with tons of vegetables. That's a keyword I'm going to use a lot. You can sneak in vegetables into mac and cheese to create family favorite mac and greens side dish, chop up steamed veggies, especially if your kids don't like to see a huge broccoli in their mac and cheese, chop it up fine with spinach, asparagus, parsley, whatever your favorite greens are, you can kind of sneak it all in. You just want to opt in for more of the green. You can be creative, mixed green bean salad, spiral laws, veggies, and fresh veggies and dips like salsa and guacamole. Who doesn't like guacamole? Yeah, you got to kind of sneak attack the kids to, to get it all in there. Uh, and of course, when it comes to these meals, it's not all about that. Uh, what's on the plate drinks. That's a huge compliment to that. So what are some tips when it comes to uh, making healthier drinks? It's really important to stay hydrated with tons of water before, during, after your barbecue, especially with the warmer temperatures. You can channel your inner mixologist and concoct healthy mocktails, infused water, and serve fun sides like lemons, limes, strawberries, even mint to encourage guests to create a refreshing, healthy drink. Iced elixirs, homemade kombucha to help with digestion. And you can chill your favorite herbal tea so it doesn't always have to be heavy alcohol. You can get that hydration by being really creative and make it fun. Okay, th there's always one in every single group that wants to go straight to dessert, <laughs> right away to dessert. Okay, so for those that have the sweet tooth, what about desserts? Yeah, there's tons of options for sweet treats and you can have a little of everything, but I always encourage fresh fruit and my kids are like, fruit is not a dessert, but make it hands on. Watermelon are great for grilling stuff like peaches, pineapple, bananas, nectarines. You can even use shish kebabs, which we love doing, and this gets your kids involved. They like to sneak in some s'mores, I'm not going to lie, but also add in that fruit so that they have a mix of both. I love it. Now, of course, it's all about environmental friendliness, right? So what can we do to reduce our carbon footprint when it, when it comes to barbecue season? There are so many little things you can do to make a huge difference. Shop local for your ingredients and even visit your farmer's market for fruits and veggies. You can make sure to serve more vegetarian options, like I mentioned, veggie burgers, tons of veggie sides. I also recommend using reusable plates and utensils instead of all the plastic and styrofoam that doesn't recycle. So we have these that we pull out every summer and we reuse them and they can even go in the dishwasher. Okay, Karina Heinrich, thank you so much for joining us with those amazing meatless meal ideas.